Hey guys, it's Hannah, and today I am bringing you the very first of my currently reading videos for the year. So if you guys watched my 2016 reading and channel resolutions video, then you know that I have decided to stop doing TBR videos on my channel this year, and instead I have decided that I want to do what I'm tentatively calling currently reading videos. So instead of telling you guys what books I plan to read in the month, I'm going to update you guys on what books I have currently been reading. Like I mentioned in that video, I always read multiple books at one time, so I am almost, if not always, in the middle of at least like three books. So in these videos, I'm basically just going to take you guys through the books that I have currently been reading that I am at least at the beginning of or somewhere in the middle of and I'm just gonna tell you guys kind of just my general thoughts on them for now and just update you guys on what I have been reading. So the first book I'm reading right now is Why We Broke Up by Daniel Handler. I started reading this a few days ago like I said and I'm about 63 pages in right now and I'm really really loving it. I knew that I was probably gonna like this book because I love Daniel Handler's writing but I'm loving it a lot more than I was expecting to and I'd actually read some negative reviews of it on Goodreads and then I was kind of getting apprehensive about picking this one up because I didn't want to not like it because I've loved everything else I've read by Daniel Handler but I'm actually really really liking it and I'm kind of regretting not reading this right after I went through a similar situation a while ago um, because it's extremely relatable and I'm really really enjoying it like I said a million times but it's very good so far so I will keep you guys updated and I plan to finish this one pretty soon within the next few days so I should be finishing it then and then I'll update you guys with my thoughts and my wrap up and everything but for now I'm really loving this one. The next book that I'm currently reading I haven't really started yet I'm on like page seven but um, it is The Order of the Phoenix by JK Rowling. If you guys follow me on Goodreads or if you guys watched my December TBR then you know that I've been kind of rereading the Harry Potter series just kind of at my own pace because I haven't reread the books since I first read the books. I've reread individual ones but I haven't read the whole series since the first time I read the series so I wanted to do that and I am on the fifth book right now and like I said I've barely even started it at all but um, I am just gonna slowly be waking my way through the rest of this series and this is the one that I am currently on right now and of course this should come as no surprise I'm absolutely loving it. I'm honestly I think enjoying it more as an adult than I did as a kid which is kind of baffling to say because I absolutely adored these books as a kid but somehow I love them even more. Part of that is definitely the nostalgia of the series but I don't care because it's just so good. The series will forever and always I think be my favorite series I've ever read and it just gets better and better with time. So I'm really enjoying making my way through the rest of these and I'm gonna be really sad when I get to the seventh one because I do not want it to end. The next book that I have quote unquote currently been reading, I say that because I haven't picked this up in months because I started reading this in 2015 and I don't mean like December 2015, I mean like July 2015. <laughs> Um, yeah, and I haven't touched it since then, but I just a couple days ago decided to pick it up again and I read like 20 more pages, so technically I'm currently reading it again. I want to finish it because I'm almost done with it, but I'm just going to show you guys the book now, but it is The Fellowship of the Ring by J.R.R. Tolkien. If you guys have been following my channel for a little while, then you probably know that I am obsessed with Lord of the Rings, but I've never read the books which makes no sense. So I decided last year that I wanted to change that because I own all of them and I ended up reading The Hobbit last year and it was kind of so-so for me. I actually personally like the movie better than I like the book of The Hobbit but I definitely think that's because it is very much a children's book but I'm really really enjoying The Fellowship of the Ring and I think I'm really gonna like the Lord of the Rings series. I am about a hundred pages from the end of this so I've like made it made it a good way through but I just haven't picked it up because I've been reading other things but I definitely want to finish this one and I'm hoping to finish it this month if I don't finish it this month that's fine because I've really been loving this series and I feel blasphemous when I say that I love Lord of the Rings but I haven't read the books it's just because I've watched the movies so many times that it's just it holds such a special place in my heart. I'm rambling now but the point is that I just really hope to finish this one very soon and I recently picked it up again so I can do that. So hopefully I'll be done with this one 
within the next few weeks. And finally, the very last book that I have currently been reading, and I say currently as in I just picked it up about an hour ago and started reading it, um, but that book is Howl's Moving Castle by Diana Wayne Jones. I watched the movie for Howl's Moving Castle for the first time yesterday, and that was my first experience with a Miyazaki movie because I had seen Kiki's Delivery Service when I was like maybe five years old, but I remember absolutely nothing from it. And all of my friends love Miyazaki movies. So we had a movie night last night and they made me watch Howl's Moving Castle and Spirited Away. So I've now seen both of those. But Howl's Moving Castle ruined me and my heart was just clenched the entire time. And I absolutely loved it. I loved it so, so much. And my friend had a copy of the book and right after I finished it, I asked if I could borrow it. She lent it to me and I'm so, so happy because I loved that movie and I'm reading the book right now and I'm loving the book and it's so good and I'm so obsessed and I already know this is gonna end up being one of my favorite books. I just love it so, so much. And just the movie was so fantastic. If you guys haven't seen it, please go watch it. I was really tentative to watch it because I'm not usually very big on animation. I like very specific movies and TV shows and things when it comes to animation. I don't really watch a lot of them, but this was just fantastic. So if you're like me and if you don't like watching animated things very often, please check these out because I promise you they're not disappointing. The animation is beautiful and the storyline is just so good that uh, it just it it's just so fantastic. I can't stop thinking about it and I can't wait to finish this, but at the same time I don't want to finish it because I don't want it to end. So those are all the books that I've currently been reading, but before I end this video I just kind of wanted to include like a currently watching in here just for one thing, not like the TV series I'm watching or something, but there have been some movies that I've been watching recently that I want to tell you guys about and just express my feelings about. If you've been following my Goodreads or if you follow my Twitter or anything, then you know that I haven't been updating a lot and I haven't been uploading as frequently as I want to and I haven't been reading as much as I usually read. And if you're wondering why that is, it's because for the past two weeks, I have been watching Star Wars. And when I say for the past two weeks, I don't mean it's taken me two weeks to watch the entire seven movie series. No, I mean that I have watched the original trilogy three times now, the prequels each twice, and the new movie also twice in theaters, because I'm so obsessed. I had never seen the Star Wars movies at all. I knew a lot of the plot points I'd been spoiled for so many things because everyone talks about Star Wars, so I already knew a lot of what was going to happen. But once the new movie came out, everybody was talking about it and everyone was talking about how much they liked it and then other people were talking about how they didn't like it and I just felt really out of the loop. So I called one of my friends and I asked her if she wanted to watch the Star Wars series with me because she'd already seen it. And so she agreed and we decided to watch them all. And like I said, it was my first time watching them and I just became so completely and utterly obsessed with this series. Like guys, I have seriously watched the original trilogy, four, five, and six, three times each now, and I could honestly sit down and watch it another three times and I wouldn't get bored. And this doesn't make any sense for me because I am not a huge sci-fi fan. Like I like sci-fi, but it's not my first choice. And also they're like cheesy 80s movies and I'm not really big on cheesy or 80s movies very much. I don't like very many of them. Nothing against them, it's just not really for me. I'm very much more into kind of dramatic, serious films, things like that, but I just fell in love with these and I can't stop watching them and thinking about them and reblogging them on Tumblr and it's just gotten out of hand and my friends think I have a problem. I think I have a problem. It's just really bad, but I just wanted to share that with you guys because honestly, that's what I've currently been doing. Like, yes, I've been reading these books, but this has all been on the back burner because Star Wars has come first. So let me know in the comments down below if you guys would be interested in watching a video on my thoughts on the Star Wars trilogy, the series, because I honestly kind of want to make a video on it where I just like sit down and talk about each of the movies, probably by trilogy, so I do like the original trilogy and then the prequels and then the new one and just kind of my thoughts on them because I would love to do that, but I don't know if you guys would like to watch that. So let me know in the comments down below if you'd be at all interested in seeing that. Because if you are, even if it's just one of you who is interested, I will make those videos because I just want to talk about Star Wars with someone 
because it's just, ah, oh, I love it. I love it so much. So that is it, guys, for my currently reading and currently watching obsessing over video for this last half of January. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. I'm really mad at myself because I haven't picked it up yet, and I don't know why, so I'm going to make this year the year that I finally read it.